So I've uh, drawn a, a bauble shape on this piece of MDF. I'm going to cut that out. And the pattern that I'm going to be doing on here is called punch work. You see a lot of punch work on early English um, frames and mirrors. The Georgian stuff especially has all this punch work on the background. Absolutely beautiful. So that's what I'm going to try and reproduce onto this. Right, I want to get some gesso on here. Right, I'll let that dry and then get the second coat on. So the baubles had 10 coats of gesso. I'm just coming in with a little sanding block and I'm going to sand that smooth. I've got this base that I've put on a block of wood with a bit of handle. If I rub that on my face, put it directly down on the gold leaf, wet this. Let's pick the gold up. And just go straight down. So the bubbles all gilded up. I've cut out this star shape. Um, I'm actually going to use a nail punch. Um, traditionally, it's sort of a, a punch mark is a circle within a circle, but I don't have that. So I've just got this little circle on the end of this nail punch. The background is usually where you see this texture happening. So what I'm going to try and do is make this star stand out by just doing the background. I don't want to draw on here because that will stay on the gold. So I'm hoping this is going to work if I just hold this down somehow. <laughs> I think I need three hands. So you put your punch where you want it and then you get a tiny little tiny little indent. Right, I only spent five minutes lining all that up. Right, I think I'm going to try and punch every point and see if I can do it without this shape on here. Right, so as you can see, I've got all those points marked. 